Yeah. Do you think that Tesla is will be able to achieve all of its goals? That, I mean, the the goals of the company is is, is huge, mm-hmm. and there's a lot of doubters and <clears throat> naysayers of what um, Tesla is doing. Naturally. And and to be frank, they haven't been off to a great start with their Model Three launch. Yeah. But well, they ma- ended up making like four thousand when they had promised to make like fifty thousand. They're yeah. way 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 behind. Do you do you see them succeeding in, in what they're setting out to do? I. I'm always hesitant about the timelines they give. Sure. Um, Because they're Elon and that whole crew is always super ambitious about, like, yeah, we'll do this in this year. Mm -hmm. And, like, the Roadster is the same thing, 2020. Yeah, right. (laughs) Like, that's going to be at least a couple years after that, I think. But I think the actual goals they're setting, they're eventually hitting them Mm -hmm. when people Mm -hmm. are saying, like, they weren't going to hit them at all. Yeah. So stuff like production of Model S, which has been ramping up kind of the same way, like, Model 3 is at the beginning of that climb. Sure. And they kind of mapped out that climb with Model S, and I think they sold their 200,000th Model S last year, which people never thought they would do. Sure, yeah. So, you know, it might not be the same. People call it Elon time. Like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's literally, it goes all the way down to, like, the time of the event. Like, he'll, he'll get on stage at 5 o'clock, and they, it's 5.03, <laughs> and we're like, yeah, maybe 5.30. <laughs> That's fine. So, timeline's not so much, but I think they eventually, eventually get Eventually they'll get there. Yeah.